Damn, I'm on a fucking roll today, guys. I'm just making a bunch of videos remembering all these, like, past events. Honestly, right now, I have, I'm just starting the recording. I have no clue what's gonna come to my mind, so we'll see. I could actually- I'll tell this story. So, this kid in my class last year. So, one of my classes, it was like a- It was a weird type of thing. It was a situation where, like, different- There's, like, this school where you go to, like, do certain things. So, in my case, it was like a- It was like an automotive class, but you leave my school and then you go to another school. And a lot of schools went to this school. It was like a bunch of different schools busing kids to this one school to learn different things. There was like fashion, there was um, there was automotive, there was welding, there was all these different different like trade type things. You know what I'm saying? The school. So my class was for, like had people from all these different schools, and like you know, getting to know them was kind of weird because I don't know. It was just a bunch of different people. There, there was just a lot of different types of people. There was like these like rich kids. There was like these weird like ghetto kids. There was just all these weird different types of people there. And I'm not like judging anyone because like whatever, but it was just like a weird different group of people. And there was this one kid, right? And he was like a huge stoner. And I'm not, I don't have anything against that at all. Like cool. He was caught smoking weed basically in class. There was like all these cars outside that would block like this camera that would watch over the whole place. So he was like kind of going behind cars and he would like smoke there, but the teacher ended up smelling it or something like that. And our teacher was like chill about that kind of stuff. He was just like, don't do it. He just acted like it and he kind of like was chill about it. Nonetheless, this, this kid was like smoking in class. Like he brought like weed and he brought like little fucking bowl things and he brought all these different like things and like vapes he brought all this stuff and eventually one day he was like caught doing it i don't remember exactly how he was caught i just remember like the security card the security guard was like called down and like they, he escorted him out and this kid you know, ended up getting kicked out of the class and he had to go to a different class and i saw him like halfway through the year i was like what happened he was like yeah dude like i was smoking weed and i had like a vape and they caught me and i, I was suspended for like this kid did a lot of crazy stuff too like he always talked about like how he was like in the hospital for different stuff like at one point i think he did like acid or something and he smoked weed and did acid and he got like really sick and he had like pump his stomach and he was in like the emergency he was in like the emergency unit or something i don't really know like he was he did a lot of crazy stuff and um i guess he was just really into drugs like him and luna would probably be good friends i'm kind of curious guys what kind of like click are you guys involved in at school i know there's like the there's like the stoners there's you know the sports people there's the gamers the nerds i mean it really doesn't matter what you part i'm not gonna judge you off of like what you do I've got friends and everything. I've got friends who play football. I've got friends who smoke weed and do drugs and have dropped acid in school. That's a whole nother story. Like, that was the funniest shit, actually. Seeing them, like, on acid, like, their fucking reaction to stuff was hilarious. You might be part of more than one. Like, I'm... Like, myself, I guess you could say I'm, part, I'm a little bit of everything. Because I've got a friend... I've got friends in literally, like, all of them. So, just let me know what, what your guys are all about. It's kind of funny when, like, somebody tweets at me and it's like, at Josie Q, at Vanna, at fucking PewDiePie, you're my favorite YouTubers. It's, like, weird because I'm, they're grouping me with these, like, huge people who have, like, millions of subscribers and I've got, like, 41,000. So it's kind of, like, it's a very weird feeling to think that, like, people like me, but they also like these other YouTubers and that they're just grouping me, like, with their, like, they, with them. They, like, think that I'm, like, some big person and, I mean, yeah, I guess you could say it's a lot of subscribers, but it's, like, weird to just think, like, they're grouping me with them. Or they'll tweet me and Jeb and be like, oh, you guys are awesome. And it's just, like, weird because Jeb's my favorite YouTuber. So it's like, when they when somebody thinks that I'm their favorite YouTuber along with Jeb, it's kind of like a crazy thing. And if you're subscribed or you're watching this video, I just want to say thank you because that, it just honestly makes my, like, day, it makes my whole, like, life. It just, it's one of the greatest feelings, knowing that people are out there that actually care to listen to what I have to say. It's a really, like, awesome feeling. Don't forget to click the like button below and subscribe down below for more for videos. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Thank you all so much for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to click the subscribe button. And then if you want to stay updated, you can always click that little uh, notification bell to the side. It'll send you push notifications to your phone if you're on a mobile device. Also, if you guys want to follow me on my Twitter, Snapchat, or Instagram, you guys can follow me on there to stay updated on all things JosieQ slash videos or just my life. So uh, that's about it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to stay chill.